check-in 31. So this is why check-in Tuesday is a little late today. Take a look. The cheeseburger sweat. I don't like cheeseburgers. Okay, I'm going to uh, check the garden real quick and then uh, go take a shower and then we'll continue. I'll be right back. All right, I uh, showered, shampooed, shaved. <laughs> Got the lawn mowed and uh, you know what I noticed today? Um, I was uh, trying to use that electric mower for the entire yard. And it's just difficult with the lawn getting, you know, this big in just a matter of a few days. Uh, we had a lot of rain, a lot of sun. Uh, that little electric mower just could not do it. So I dragged out the, uh, the gas powered sit down mower. No problem. I was able to take care of the rest of the lawn in Oh, I don't know, 20 minutes, half an hour, and um, uh, stayed away from cussing a lot, quite frankly. So sometimes we use tools to make the job easier, um, and we think we can use those tools uh, for everything. Now, that electric lawnmower does great around the edges and around the plants and that kind of thing. Great, that's what it does best. And then I gotta drag out the bigger mower because uh, that's what's needed. It reminds me of something that I read today. Let me get this out. It comes from Psalms 103. It's verse 19. The Lord has made the heavens his throne. From there he rules over everything. Okay, now that sounds like, hmm, if he rules over everything, the way I see everything going right now, he's not doing a very good job. One might say that. However, if you realize we're trying to see things through our lens, not God's lens. It's kind of like trying to use the wrong mower to mow the whole lawn. You just can't do that. It doesn't work. You'll end up being frustrated. So look through the world through God's lens and it all starts to make sense. It really does. So I encourage you, take a look at the Word of God. Ask Him for a bit of wisdom because in the book of James, uh, James says, if you ask for wisdom, God will give it to you liberally. You really will. It'll help you see that using the sit-down mower is the right thing. <laughs> you know what I'm really saying, right? Well, that's it. I hope you're doing good today. Leave me a message uh, if you need for me to pray for you or leave a message if uh, things are going great. You know how to do it. I'm going to put the links all down below. I'll put the thing over here and up there and all of that. And uh, I'm going to go make some lunch now. I hope you have a wonderful day. We'll see you next time. God bless you. God bless America. May America bless God.